といがコロロラトゥマイチキマタモチャンコテコレナテコレカトテコトポスポユリスポタウンタウンスポチブチブスポロスポテコテキチアナテポテコテキチアアブテキチファイヤーチャーマラマチヘイスポリオネトゥタヘイチヘキトタトゥカイアアラヒマイネタタコパコカイエヘロタラマイタキワアキロテキテノノファルトファルトポウマホイエヘミエティミヘチキアコトウエマホイエトゥマトウエティミヘチラキカウナタナラトウヤリアタトウタガトウパカ私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、ミヒマハナテニ、キャコトツファン。ミヒマハナテニ、キャコトツファン。キャタコトエタ、サトラマチラ。ディダム、ネイ。ムエトナパパチポナ、イリメネルトカラ。エヘナレモケナコエ。オチェラウテラノパパガテカムロモアヤカ。ラウテタコトメラ、ダワヒ。イパラミヒ、ウタ。キルマケイテラフィンのファミリーイテナクエテラマチラテラウィリテナクエトウィガマハラキャクエコピコピコネイトカンアホケチキイテナクエトカウマチョウマアタタウトモトモトウマヘネトウイロトウイマヘコチュマトウアミティミヘキャクエイテラマチラパパ
some reason got burned down. There were different stories in terms of what happened to that church. But anyway, he built this church. He was the mastermind behind the whole architecture, the whole design of the church, and the local carvers were from Uepoha. You know who that carver was? Anyway, he was the master carver of Uepoha. What was it? That was the first idea in my mind when Ramani came to ask me about the procedure when they come back here. I said, he must come here first. He could be in front of his grandfather and his grand uncle up there. Because originally I have seen Fergo Richard Grass there. It was actually three angels. And, and I suspect, I may not be right, but I put in and took those three angels out and put these two men there in place. As a fitting gesture in terms of the city kneeling in nobility to Jesus Christ, who visited us via the Gospel in 1834. And the font at the back of the church, was one of the ones responsible for bringing the Gospel here to Ngati Prabhu. And hence we have a Tearawa pulpit here. It's carved by Tearawa. And underneath are six men. It took me a long time to find out the history behind that. The history behind those six figures represent the old Maori gods. But if you look at them closely, they have their arms up stretched like this, holding up the tomb of the Kaipuru, holding up the, the pulpit of the preacher. So what does that mean? Now, Tato Tipur Rata Rata Omua, acknowledging the new word of Christ that came to Ngati Pro. You know, keep reminding us our history which was not taught to us during our time here until now. <coughs> of that history when the gospel right here put paid to our unfriendliness towards one another. Te Rao Taho Teo, Te Rao Taho Teo. Matters turned us into vegetarians. <laughs> That's a fact and reality. We were non vegetarians, our tribe in those days. It was unbelievable for us to wait years to find our own history. Why our own history wasn't taught to us what our people were like. But it was the gospel that brought peace and tranquility between us, this side of the river and the other side. And oh, what joy there was for our people. They accepted this man called Jesus Christ. We still when we talk about our soul in the Tumatau, on our Mara. The platform we use, have a fake order to one another, the visitors to the locals. And we use that platform as a platform of talking to other one, one, one side to the other. <coughs> So they haven't been forgotten. Uh, when we talk about the weather, Tafari Market, we talk about our local railway station, talks to us about the Anenga Tuhu Tafari Mate. Do we using that terminology in our everyday living? It's a reminder that there is beauty in our Atu Omua. There is beauty in our real Omua. I don't do Atu Tuhu. When we read Harata Mehiku, Hikume Rongakuru, just to give a bit of brief history. 1924 was built, 1926 was opened. And, and to pay to all these people in this memory. I'm just waiting for the two leaves on the left here for, uh, for Dr. Monty Suter to come and put those name, further names up on there. Martin Arad. He first of all, he gave us 1,000 names. We can't fit them all on that board. Because we're trying to be selective. We don't know where
chaplain to work as well. They could come in and they didn't sing out of it. Don't be shy. Gracious and loving God, draw near to us in this time of remembrance. Draw us closer to your bosom. That we may hear your heartbeat and your spirit speaking to us this day and tomorrow. Come and be with us, stand with us, sit with us, laugh with us as we remember stories of the past. Loving Jesus, we thank you for your sacrifice on the cross and for the sacrifice of many of our men and women in the Defence Force, giving up their lives so that we may experience what we have today. May our hearts and minds be opened to your spirit, <coughs> remembering all who have gone before us, those who uphold us, those who speak into our lives today from the past, those who we remember as whānau. Enrich our lives, we pray, with the memories of the past, <coughs> So that your love, your peace, your hope may instill in us a sense of being part of this special place. Lord, hear the quiet thoughts upon our hearts and our minds. Support us at this time. Love us as your children, as you loved those who have gone before us. Strengthen us this day to meet the challenges that are before us. And encourage us, Lord, to follow the way of your Son, Jesus Christ, who is the way, the truth, and the life. This we pray in and through the name of Christ, our Rock and our Redeemer. Amen. Amen.